Hello everyone, here is a video on how to factory reset this Belkin RT3200 router. Uh, so if you've forgotten the admin password or uh, for some reason can't get in or you need to reset its settings because something's messed up with it, um, here is how you do it. So normally with most routers you have to get a paperclip um, to poke a recessed reset button. But on this router at the top, at the back, is just a reset button that you can get to without putting in a pin. So I'm going to get my finger ready on that and I'll let you know when I'm going to press it. I'm also going to show you what the lights look like on the front when I do so. So I'm now going to press the button now. And after about 10 seconds, the power light has started flashing and I've now let go of the reset button. So this router takes quite some time to reboot, so we'll just wait for the power light to go solid and the internet light will uh, also go possibly orange and then it will go white. There you go, the internet light has gone solid white and I'm just waiting a moment to see whether the when the wireless uh, appears in my list of available networks. And there we go, we have the Belkin wireless has appeared. That's gone back to factory settings because I had a custom name on that before. So hopefully that video has been helpful to you. If it has, it would be really helpful to me if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my YouTube channel. You don't need to have the video notification switched on, but the subscriber numbers really do help. If you're interested as well, on uh, the description of this video, there will be two, at least two other links to other videos. One of them is uh, more information about this router and its web admin interface. And then there's another video on how to put OpenWRT on this router, uh, which is a custom routing operating system, um, custom firmware for the router. So have a look at those videos if that's helpful to you as well. Thanks very much for watching.